Hey guys, so um, this morning I have to basically do some car repairments with my car and so I'm currently, since my car is dead, I have to walk to Walmart and that's what I'm doing right now. So, you guys are going to see a little bit how I might struggle on fixing my car but as well as doing some shopping. So hopefully this will be an eventful vlog, hopefully not a fail vlog, but Nevertheless, um, I hope you enjoy it and uh, just keep walking, keep watching. Wow, hello. Um, yeah, sorry for the wind. Like I said, I'm walking to Walmart right now, and I'm almost there. There's Sam's, and then there's Walmart. So I'm almost there. Almost there. It's a little bit chilly outside though. <sighs> All right, so Walmart's pretty busy, and um, I didn't be really want to be the one to record because honestly it's quite awkward but that's okay. Um, I finished with my grocery shopping. Um, let's see what I got. I got some tortilla chips. All of this is whole um, whole wheat, um, non-added sugars or anything like that or anything much added. I got some salsa and guacamole. Um, let's see, some veggie meat. Uh, let's see, whole wheat tortillas, bananas and apples, figs. Avocados, hummus, and raisins. So, we should be pretty good for, uh, I should be pretty good for a while. And, um, like I said, all I have left is to go ahead and grab my battery for my car. And, um, yeah, let's go do that right now. Hopefully this turns out okay, because I really have no idea what I'm doing. And that's okay, it's, it's a learning process. And just a shout out to my dad, he's watching. He should be proud right now because I have no idea what I'm doing into why they're not to fix or not fix. Um, and so I need to get a battery and a wrench um, because I could ask, but I'm one of those people who doesn't like asking because uh, I feel like I bother people, but that's okay. Um, we're going to find a wrench and then um, also get the battery. So let's go do that right now. I'm getting a lot of weird looks, but that's okay. I think the hard part is starting, because you're just like, uh, should I start recording now, or now, or now? And then once you do it, you're just like, okay, I could, they're not going to stop me. They're never, probably never going to see me again, unless I run into people who actually go to school here, because it's right across campus. But that's okay. I'll just be like, hey, you want to be in my video? Um, okay. This always makes me feel like an overly woman, because I just see a lot of guys here. weird things on the floor. Batteries. Found them. Oh boy. Not to actually find which one. Okay. I gotta get on video because I have a picture of it. So I gotta figure out which one's which. But oh my gosh. Batteries are exp so expensive. What is this? 100 bucks. 85 bucks. Are you kidding me? Oh this is grid technology which is like really expensive. This stuff is expensive. Okay, so I think I found my battery by looking at this little chart. Um, so hopefully, what it says, it's this one. Um, Dad, I hope I'm getting the right one. Uh, hopefully, these things are heavy, though. Uh, you just gotta love those embarrassing moments where you have to leave stuff. Because, hey, you just don't have enough money, and that's the time that this happened to me. Um, I had to get my battery, and I had to get wrenches. And I had to get stuff to clean the corrosion. And everything that you saw that I got for groceries, I couldn't get. <laughs> so, except for like one avocado, which is really sad. But you know what? Like, you gotta do what you gotta do. Luckily, praise the Lord that, like, I'm getting a check from Amazon because I sold the book. So, I'll be back to buy food. So, don't worry. Um, I have to walk back with this battery. It's so heavy. Guys, I'm really not out of shape. It's just this battery is really heavy and I have to wear it really awkwardly like to the side like this because if I carry it on my back it's going to break my back and so oh, the walk I will see you back um, when I'm trying to attempt to fix my car great yay I made it to a really, really creepy tunnel this is a creepy tunnel because imagine 
like, at night. I don't walk at night, but it's pretty scary. And so, they have this pedestrian tunnel instead of, like, crossing over railroad tracks, because that's unsafe. And so, I thought I'd just show you the tunnel. I put it on my back, and, like, I feel like I have to walk off like a turtle. It's really bad. It's really sad. But, I'm going to walk a really long hill that goes really up, and then, it's like, I'm done. So, I'll be doing, like, a victory dance. Put Eye of the Tiger now. <laughs> Commence that now, because it's really, really tired. Sorry. Scanning. Ooh, fancy doors. You have to have, like, ID to get in through. But, yeah. And my school's doing a whole bunch of construction, so that's always fun. This is not fun. Nope, not at all. Nope. I don't like this. <sighs> I made it. Frankie, never been so glad to see you. Frankie. All right. <laughs> Alright, so I finally made it, and you guys can't really see, but I'm at the hood of my car right now, and so I really hope I got the right battery. Oh gosh, my back really hurts, but... Alright, so we are... I'm going to attempt to at least try and fix this. Um, this is what the hood of my car looks like, the inside of my hood, so... So the battery's right here, so... Yeah... We're gonna do this. We're gonna do this pretty good. All right, let me go get the battery and stuff. So I got two other things, uh, pretty much beside the battery, and it was acid cleaner, basically for the wires and stuff. And then I got my little wrench collection over here. Woohoo! So hopefully, um, this isn't as hard as I think it's gonna be, and hopefully, it's gonna be really, really a piece of cake. Uh, dead. Yeah. Why aren't you here to help me right now? Um, but, I guess it's time to get started. <laughs> okay, so I'm running into a little bit of a problem. The hardest part is basically trying to get this little lever in here. Here, let me show you, sorry. It's like you see where, I'm not sure if you can see that at all, but basically it's trying to get into right there and trying to loosen that up and that's the hardest part right now where I'm just finding a bunch of difficulty because my hand is like in some sort of contraption like a con tortoise that's even a word <laughs> and it's just really 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 bolted in there from the angle that I'm trying to get at and <laughs> hey guys, uh, so my dearest apologies, uh, I was going to film and I'll explain a little bit what happened with my car, luckily Frankie is not working and that's where I'm currently in right now, and so, um, basically, I couldn't do it alone, it was not a self-effort, uh, try, my friend, uh, is the sweetest person ever now I just like uh, just help me she had tools and she helped me with a car and then a stranger came by who is on campus and helped us out and um, with the help of Google and our heads together we finally got figured out our whole uh, just German European Volkswagen contraption in the hood um, just how it's so much more different than a Ford or any other car that can be easily changed but with that being said um, just I'm sorry I couldn't record it but uh, it just it was really tough and um, really messy but it's so done and it's so worth it and um, just so glad it worked out all all together and I'm just really happy and um, so I apologize but I hope you guys are doing awesome, and I'm sure you guys will have more videos, and maybe, who knows, I will just do for those, and for YouTube, or for any other Volkswagen owners who want to do it themselves, I'll maybe even just do a video, uh, just for the general public, <laughs> um, just a general public announcement how to do that, because it was a hassle, it was really hard, and, um, totally worth the four hours or however many hours I spent on the car because Frankie is not working he is running and I'm so excited I am so blessed and yeah <laughs> all right
Alright guys, well, I, I will surely see you at another time. Um, but take care, and I will see you until next time.